Welcome to Daytona Beach, Florida, home to Hangsters Hot Rods, Muscle Car, and Collector Car Showroom. We are not a consignment dealership. We own all the cars in our building. So when you are dealing with us, you're dealing directly with the seller. If you're watching this video on YouTube, please be sure to check out our website. It's hangsters.com. This is where you can find all of our most current inventory. Our YouTube videos, we leave up at all times, uh, whether they were shot a day ago or two years ago. Uh, between both of our showrooms, we leave them all on YouTube for you guys to view. However, on our website, not only do we have these videos that we are doing for you right now, but we also have at least 80 and on the upwards of 100 um, high definition still photos of each car um, in our building. So you can examine the uh, pictures really closely as well. You cannot go with, uh, when, you're, when you're talking about muscle cars, uh, American muscle, you cannot go without talking about, of course, the Chevy Camaro. This one we're going to present to you today happens to be a 1977. <clears throat> it is a real Z28. Uh, it does have power steering, does have power brakes. If you look underneath there real closely, you can see there is no AC compressor, so it does not have air conditioning. Um, I'm going to venture to say that this is the number matching motor for the car. Uh, engine block numbers 3970014, which uh, Chevrolet did use in the late 70s in their vehicles. So if it's not a numbers matching motor, it is at least a numbers, uh, you know, period correct motor. Lowering the hood, uh, you can see the cool hood scoop there in the center. Uh, the Camaro logo here on the front nose. Z28 badging on the front grille. <clears throat> Uh, the paint quality on the car overall is, uh, I would consider it above a driver quality paint job. Um, I don't have any documentation on the car. I don't know if it's original paint. If it is original paint, it sure is uh, in very nice condition. Um, if it is a repaint, somebody did a very nice job. Uh, Tiger Paw Uniroyal uh, radial tires on the front. Uh, the Z28 uh, proper rims for the car on the vehicle. <clears throat> A uh, window glass on the car all the way around is in really good condition. Dual mirrors are uh, going to be painted the same color silver as the car. Check out the interior. One thing that makes the car desirable, of course, is what you see in the center there. It is a four-speed center console car. Bucket seats, obviously, in the front. Steering wheel's in good shape. We'll take a little uh, closer look at the dash here later on in the test drive presentation. Uh, the dashboard itself uh, in good condition. I don't see any rips or tears in the vinyl. Headliner looks to be, uh, I guess, perfect. Uh, sun visors are in good shape. I don't see, again, any rips or tears in the vinyl. Front seat belts, rear seat belts. Um, there's no uh, discoloration. It's kind of hard to see. It's black. Um, no discoloration fading in the carpeting or in the floor mats. Dome lights functioning, really nice looking car inside. <clears throat> and like I said, uh, highly desirable combination with the uh, four speed, of course the real Z28. Um, check out down the side of the car, door fitment on the driver's side is exceptional. It's gonna be the same on the passenger side. Uh, again, rear window glass, real nice there. You got some speakers uh, sticking up there out of the hat rack in the back. We will see if those work later on when we uh, turn on the radio. Z28 badging on the deck lid in the center with your little spoiler here on the back. Uh, deck lid fitment to the driver side and passenger side rear quarters there is uh, good. Got your original inflatable little tiny spare there with a uh, little breaker bar. You see the trunk's nice and solid. The uh, odometer on the car reads 96,000 miles. Uh, the title on the car reads exempt. Uh, we don't know the actual mileage on this car. I don't know if it's a true 96,000 mile car. I don't know if it's flipped one or two times, um, you know, but it's, uh, very high quality car. When you um, buy and sell as many cars as we do per year, you notice when a um, car of higher quality comes through the doors. And this is definitely one of those cars. If you're looking for a late 70s Camaro, 
Uh, this is one of the nicer ones that you can uh, probably find out there. So the passenger side door panel, <coughs> passenger side seat, uh, carpeting, uh, glove compartment, everything is in uh, really nice condition. Later on when we're doing the test drive video, you can kind of take a look closer look at the center console. It's just, um, again, when you're looking over a car, buying a car, selling a car, you can see many aspects of the vehicle that will lead you to believe how the vehicle was cared for over the years and what kind of condition um, not only is, is it currently in, but uh, the condition of the car uh, over its lifetime. And this is, uh, this is a high quality car. You can tell the uh, hood fitment to the front, uh, driver's side, passenger side, uh, front fenders there is really nice. Uh, everything lines up good. I don't see any uh, chips around the front fenders to speak of. Everything in the front, the front bumper, uh, around the front grill uh, looks to be in, in pretty, pretty good shape there. I did not see any blistering, cracking, fading, nothing in the paint. Like I said, I, I would consider, you know, paint's always a hard question. People ask you, well, what's the paint like? And of course, 10 is perfect, right? Um, I'd probably rate this paint an eight and a half. It's a pretty nice paint job on this car. But let's take it outside, uh, put it on the lift, and I haven't been underneath this car yet, so it'll be a first for me too. Let's check out what the undercarriage of the car looks like. Underneath our 1977 Camaro Z28, uh, we have front disc brakes. It's kind of hard to see with the uh, exhaust pipe and the cross member and everything, but I don't see anything coming down the sides of the 350. I don't see any issues with the oil pan gasket at this time. Looks pretty decent. Uh, frame rails on the car definitely look good. Same thing with the floor pans. You have one single pipe coming, oh, I'm sorry. There's two pipes coming down off of the exhaust manifold, going into one pipe and then coming in the back and wiring out into two pipes again. So uh, everything on the exhaust system looks good there. E-brakes uh, intact and hooked up, functioning. Uh, again, dual mufflers on either side of the uh, drive shaft there. Rear leaf springs look good. Uh, 373 gears in the rear end. It does not have posi. We get asked about the posi question a lot, so I will try to start stating in the videos whether it has posi traction or not. Um, we don't always check them before we do the videos. Uh, sometimes it's done after the fact, but generally on the website, if it says it has posi, it has posi, and if it doesn't say, then it does not. So, uh, great looking car underneath. Again, I would consider this a, a higher quality uh, driver car. We sell driver quality cars, but uh, this one is in, in nice shape, both inside out, structurally, mechanically. But please do not just take my word for it. Come on down to Daytona Beach. Uh, we are in late December here in Daytona. It's 75 degrees out in sunshine today, so it's a great spot to visit in the wintertime, especially if you're uh, suffering from cabin fever up north and need to get outdoors a little bit. Come on down, we'll take a drive in one of these cars. I'll show you our uh, 25,000 square foot showroom where we own all of our cars. You guys can put it on the rack, look at it underneath, look at the doors underneath, look at the paint, take it on a drive, see how the car runs. We'd be more than happy to have you down. With that being said, about nine out of every 10 deals that we do are done sight unseen. So we sell a lot of cars through pictures, videos, emails, phone calls, and so on. We do offer financing. Actually, we do not, we, we offer the ability to finance. We have three different collector car lenders that we work with. Um, they will do up to a 10-year loan on these cars, uh, depending on the price of the car, your credit score, debt-to-income ratio, uh, things of that nature. They will contact you directly. You can uh, hit the Finance tab through our website, fill out an application. The lenders will contact you directly. And if you like what you hear as far as down payment, monthly payment rate, and term, then you can certainly contact us, uh, put a deposit on the car, and uh, move forward uh, with the purchase. It's a lot easier than you think. Generally, from start to finish, from the time we take the deposit, um, whether you're a cash buyer or financing, from the time the car is sitting in your driveway or in your garage, you're generally talking uh, 10 to 14 business days, maybe even shorter, depending on where you're located in the country. Obviously, the closer to Florida you are, the faster the car gets to you. 
Let's put the car on the ground, take it on a drive, see how it runs. Okay, let's go through our 77 uh, Z28 here. We have some uh, windshield wipers. And they uh, park back where they should. Uh, I did notice we have a little tiny uh, chip there in the windshield. I'm not going to have that fixed, so unless it splits, um, if you guys are interested in the car, uh, you know, we can certainly negotiate having a new windshield put in, but there is a little tiny stone chip there um, in the front windshield on the driver's side. Fuel gauge is functioning. Battery voltage also. Speedometer is as well. We'll show you that in a little bit. RPM. Yep. Okay, turn signals. Let's see where those are at here. Driver's side. Passenger side, those are both functioning. Uh, temp gauge is not up yet, but it functions. Running lights function. Can't see those. Uh, radios working. That's kind of cool. Uh, again, I told you the center console is in good shape around the shifter. Uh, the armrest here, everything uh, is in good condition. I mentioned earlier 98,000 miles on the odometer. We do not know if that's uh, actual mileage or if it's flipped over or none of that. Horn working. This is a uh, high quality 77Z28. Let's see how it runs. This car is everything you could want in a classic car, a muscle car. Uh, great response in the wheel here. Speedometer's right where it should be. It's not bouncing all around. Uh, the car has some pull to it, some acceleration, but it's not excessive. Uh, let go of the wheel, it drives down the road nice and straight. I mean, it drives like a brand new car down. I mean, it's great. No vibrations in the uh, gear shifter here. In the seat, in the floor, in the front tires, the car runs out um, just as good as it looks. Really nice, high quality Camaro, 1977 Z28. These, uh, the first gen Camaros have always been popular as hell. Like this, you know, your 67, 68, 69. These um, middle 70s, late 70s Camaros are really making a push. And this one, um, being a, a silver um, real Z28 with probably the correct motor in it, um, in it, all the aesthetics that it has from the interior to the paint. Look at that, 75 miles per hour. And the car's not shaking all over the road. It's not sounding like or feeling like it's gonna fall apart. I was able to get 60 in third. Um, we just ran out of road number one and you know we have people in front of us. Got a Hyundai passing me. I guess they wanna race. But uh, as I was saying, uh, with the aesthetics of the car, uh, the interior, the exterior, uh, the undercarriage, just a really nice, you can tell, again, I, I stated earlier in the video, I don't know if it's the original paint on the car, um, but you could tell how the car has been cared for by how it performs, um, how it looks interior, how it looks exterior, how everything lines up. You can tell you got the original factory spare in the trunk. It's just, there's a lot of things you can tell about this car. Um, just by looking at it and doing the presentation that I'm doing on it, so. As you can see, I'm coming up on a bus, but that was 50 miles per hour again. I The transmission shifts just like it should. Steering wheels not shaking all around, you know, uh, no front end vibration. Just a really nice car. This would make a good uh, first collector car for somebody. It's gonna be offered at a reasonable price point. 
We do offer at full retail price on probably 90% of our vehicles, uh, free shipping and a 12 month, 12,000 mile powertrain warranty. The warranty is good anywhere in the lower 48 United States that is ASC certified. Um, it covers engine, transmission, and rear end. You're gonna have $100 uh, out of pocket expense um, on a covered repair and then the warranty company's gonna pick up the remainder. Uh, we do not have our own shipping company. Uh, we have a shipper that we subcontract to ship our vehicles um, at full retail price. It includes shipping to you in the lower 48 United States. If we negotiate the price of the car, um, then we negotiate uh, the shipping costs. You know, you're welcome to get your own carrier. You're welcome to pick the car up on a trailer. Um, but if we negotiate the price of the car, you're just going to pay the driver uh, when they arrive with the car. Uh, wherever we're shipping it to in the United States. Today we're going to put at least 80 photos of this car up on our website, along with this video presentation we're doing for you right now. We are located in Daytona Beach, Florida. Our phone number is 386-944-9219. And once again, our website is hangsters.com. We would love to earn your business. Check us out.